the Emperor of Nilfgaard. He's come out to show off his new robe. Such exquisite robes. when I was a lass, but no one bought them, so I branched out. Now I deal in snuffs, puffs, all sorts of fun things. What'll you have, sweeties? Magic beans. Do you have any? If it's not the new name of some kicker I already have, dearies, then no. But maybe you'd like some. Hey, where'd you get that ribbon? That's mine. Is that so? Then why was it lying in the bushes? Find us keepers, sweetheart. The ribbon. Mind explaining what the fuss is about? There's not much to explain. I got it from Aturius Vigo when I was a child. It was to protect me from evil. It clearly didn't work, given how I ended up. But it means a lot to you. How should I put this? I have so few mementos from my childhood, and the ribbon reminds me of the good old days, when I was someone else. Dears. Could you continue this touching scene elsewhere, hmm? You're scaring away my customers. Give Sienna the ribbon. Why not, huh? Sugar Plum. The only thing I hand out for free is a first hit. To get them to come back for a second, of course. For all else, you've got to pay. What if I asked you nicely? Ask me nicely and I might play you for it. A round of cards? All right, let's play. If you lose, you give me the ribbon. Don't get your hopes up. None can best me at Gwent.
good at this. A word to one skiffin. The ribbon's yours. Now skedaddle. All right. Tell me. What? What you want in return. You're not doing this out of the kindness of your heart. Don't want anything in return. I... Hmm. Thank you. Recognize it? Once upon a time, a terrible dragon attacked Vizina. It took a clever young cobbler to bring about its defeat. Right. Every now and again, some village idiot tries to imitate him. And I gotta come in to clean up the mess. time it's been you've changed whereas you not at all big bad wolf though it seems you've started running with the wrong crowd and who should i run with eh thumbelina one shot and she's under the table but 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 what brings you listen looking for magic beans seen any was given one for safekeeping, but... Where is it? Talk! Shh, not so loud. Oh, I can be much louder than this. And resort to other means of persuasion. Ah, oh, right there, the threats. Siana to a T. Listen, I exist to restage a fairy tale. If you want to play at it, I'll be happy to oblige. But it won't be easy. The thing is, little Red Riding Hoods popped her clogs. What? A thousand times they cut my gut open, filled it full of rocks and drowned me in the river. So once you stopped coming, I decided to repay the little imp for all her loving labor. Good <laughs> now, what's at the bottom of the well? She and the hunter, which means we can't play. And I'm under no obligation to talk to you, not about beans, nor anything else. So leave me be. Sort of. Hmm. Wolf's pretty cranky. Surprised? Think about it. He was cast in the role of the nemesis without ever asking for it. It's a dog's life, I tell you. So, what now? Don't worry. I'll play with him. Or rather, play him. I just need that little red hood. 
A piece of apparel, that is. Not the poor girl's corpse. That's a relief. You wish to help me? Here's your chance. Jump in the well and fish it out. Well, chop chop. Jump in the well. Break a leg. Any luck? Yep. Look what I got. That would never fit you. Give it to me. How do I look? Honestly? So-so. Women must love you. Actually, I do just fine. Let's go see the big bad wolf. Let me guess. You'll play the granddaughter. Mm-hmm. And you, the hunter. You again? I thought I was clear. I will not talk to you if little Red Riding Hood is not with you! Not a problem. Sienna can take her place. What? Very well. It's not as if I can forbid you. <laughs> Granddaughter, come closer, sweetie. But, Grandmama, what big eyes you have. The better to see you with, my dear. Granny, what big eyes? arms you have. The better to embrace you is, my dear. And Grandmama, what big teeth you have. 
Hey. The better to eat you with, my dear. Joss said about the red bean. A human has it, and he definitely didn't swallow it. Mm hmm. Gotta open his belly. Bottle caps, fake teeth, a corkscrew. Ah, here it is. Red bean. Ah, at last we have them all. What? Now I find myself wondering if you're just horribly discreet, or if those mutations completely scrubbed away your curiosity. In your shoes, I'd have myriad questions. For instance, Siana, whatever became of you after they drove you out? But you? Nothing. You avoid all talk of it. Well, since you brought it up, I'd gladly hear about it. The flower of Toussaint's nights took me all the way to the Ketu wilderness and left me there alone, without a copper, in a torn lace dress, right when the frosts were setting in. They assumed something would eat me, or that I'd do everyone a favor and die of hunger. But as always, I failed to live up to expectations. I wandered the woods for a week, went purple from the cold, gnawed the bark from twigs. Finally, I saw a light among the trees. A campsite. They were bandits, bearded, drunk, spattered with blood. And I was sure they'd rape me or kill me, or both. Take it neither happened? That's when I learned a robber and a murderer can be a better man than a knight in shining armor. They took me in, we set off for Nazaire, and I did what I could to repay them. I advanced in their ranks rather quickly. Eventually, I became their leader. Of the whole ragged band. Been through a lot. I have. And throughout this time, my sister was stomping grapes and shagging minstrels on down bedding. She wasn't the one to banish you. And I'm not angry at her for that. I'm angry at her because she forgot about me. Right. We've had our chat. Come. This is the spot. Pull out the beans. Thank <laughs> you. 
wait. Why? The stalk will sprout abruptly, very abruptly. We must be careful. All right, toss them. Something's always got to go wrong. The home stretch. Admire the view later. First, we must deal with... Him. you this land had gone ape mad, though I did not expect it to be so severe. Can't help thinking you might have done that on purpose. Why ever would I have? To get rid of your guard, your captor. Getting close to the exit at this point. We think you don't need me anymore. Well, you're wrong. You still stand to be quite useful to me. That's so? How? Plan to use me like you did Dedloff? 
No, I need you for a purpose far simpler. Well, don't just stand there and stare. I need a man, Geralt, and I'm not afraid to say it. I have no idea what awaits me once we leave this place. Treat it as my last wish. Just gonna go our separate ways. No parting words. Did you wish to tell me something? Actually, that'd probably be best. Oh my. No woman's ever treated you this way. Not that I recall, no. In that case, at last you felt what so many women in this world feel at times. <sighs> I just hope this tale has a happy ending. For me, for you, for everyone. That may very well depend on you. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing beyond what you heard. For now. Come. The exit's this way. not to be trusted. Just curious. Why do you want the Heart of Toussaint and the Ducal Wine? They were my right. My due. Doubt we would have figured you out if you hadn't tried to get them. Know that, don't you? I do. And I regret nothing. One lives but once. Here. We need but jump into the well. You first. <laughs> 